So this is really a special time for me. I've never had the opportunity to work with someone that the street was named after them. So I'd like to introduce you to Major Bruce Henwood. And this morning we are standing on Henwood Street in Garrison Green. Bruce, maybe you could tell us a little bit of how the street was named after you. Well, this, we can go back a bit in, in history. This used to be a part of a, a British Commonwealth Air Training Plan airfield during the Second World War. And then uh, in the 50s, it was redeveloped into military housing for Curry Barracks. And then uh, and in, when the base closed in 1998, Canada Lands Corporation took over uh, this area, redeveloped it, uh, did all the redeep services, changed everything, including realignment of the streets. And so when they redeveloped, they changed the, uh, the 13 streets and named them after uh, Canadian uh, peacekeepers. Uh, and I was honored to be one of those 13 uh, chosen to have this street named after me. In the early part of the year 2000, I had the pleasure of working with Barry and Wallace Chow and the Resonance Corporation, and it was a great experience. Maybe, Bruce, you can tell me about how you came to chose this home in Garrison Green. Well, Resonance built that whole complex, and I had the opportunity of meeting Barry at Peacekeepers Park just uh, in front of me here. And uh, he said, this is your street, this is my building, maybe we can come up with some sort of an agreement. And uh, that led to a, uh, about a year-long uh, adventure where uh, Barry said, uh, if you're interested, um, Phase four is just opening up, and he said, I would, I would suggest you get the top floor, looking down the street to Peacekeepers Park. And so I ended up getting uh, that uh, condo, the top floor balcony, the four windows to the right on Henwood Street. The rest is history. Major Bruce Henwood, thank you for your contributions, thank you for all that you have given to our country and for all of the people globally that you have impacted. And just want to share the story of the man behind the condo.